Hi, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Hannah and I am a fashion blogger that is starting to come out with some more YouTube videos. Um, I'm all about having both a life and a wardrobe of intention. We do a lot of wardrobe videos on here, closet staples. I do a lot of come shopping with me videos um, and just other videos that help you to live a more intentional life. So if you like any of those things, definitely be sure to hit the subscribe button. I would love to have you as a part of the community. Uh, but let's get into today's video. Today's video is um, one of my segments, which is a come shopping with me segment where I take you in store with me and we look for those classic timeless closet staples. I have one on the little black dress, I have one on the white button up top, and I also have one on the fitted cardigan. Um, but due to the current circumstances, it's not safe for us to be out in stores shopping and a lot of us are home quarantine. So I thought that we would do um, a come shopping with me quarantine edition where I kind of take you through some pieces that you can buy online now while you're kind of have a little extra time on your hands. And I can walk you through, through some of those key pieces that you can add to your wardrobe now so that by the time we go throughout, through this process, we get out into the weather again, we're gonna be ready for spring. So these are some spring staples that are really gonna get you through the next season. Um, a lot of them are timeless, classic, but I also pulled some pieces that are new from upcoming collections. I'm featuring both um, you know, high street like H&M, but I'm also, you know, showing you some other alternative higher end pieces as well. So whatever your budget is, I think you're going to find something in this video that you're going to like um, and definitely keep watching to see my spring staples quarantine edition. Okay, so let's get into the first piece. And of course, it is the classic little white dress. Now, I already have a video on the little black dress, but I think a lot of people forget about the little white dress. She is just as important. She is the little sister to the little black dress. And um, she really can take us through a lot of different occasions in the upcoming spring and summer months. So I have two picked out for you here today. The first one is a classic shirt style dress by H&M. Um, this one actually has more of a puff sleeve detailing as well, which makes it a little bit more fun. Um, it does have a tie around, which you're able to kind of give yourself a little bit more waist definition. Um, tie waists are really great for so many different body types because um, you can kind of tailor it to fit your shape. If you are hourglass or pear, I love things with the tie detail so you can really emphasize your smaller waist. Um, so this one is from the Joanna Ortiz H&M collection. Um, if this is still available, I will definitely be sure to link it in the description box below. But you know, a classic shirt dress is truly what I said, a classic because um, first of all, a linen material is going to be very breathable for the summer months. It's going to take you through that hot weather, um, you know, so you're going to be a little bit less likely to sweat through it. So that's why linen is such a great fabric, especially during the warm months. Um, a shirt dress, um, I think the reason it became such a staple is because it really is just very versatile. You can pair it with a denim jacket, you can dress it up with wedges, you can wear it in the daytime and transition it into the evening time. It's appropriate for work. So I think there's just so many reasons to introduce a shirt dress into your wardrobe. Um, a light blue color is very popular for a shirt you know, shirt dress style, but um, if you just kind of want to go for a basic white dress, then this is just such a great staple. And like I said, um, Joanna Ortiz is actually a, a famous designer and she did a collaboration with H&M, so you know you're getting a very high quality designed piece for a much more affordable price. Okay, so the second little white dress that I wanted to show you is by Tallulah La Maison. And um, first of all, I hope I pronounced that correctly. We'll find out. Um, but this is from a recent blog post that I did. I did a collaboration with them. And this is just such a beautiful white dress. If you are a bride or if you um, are looking for something to wear for your rehearsal dinner, for your bridal shower, um, or just to wear, um, you know, maybe after your wedding, on your honeymoon, this is just such a beautiful, well-designed white dress that's definitely a little bit more original. Um, it has some really beautiful ruffle detailing. Um, this is a little tie tassel detail that allows you to kind of pull in the waist a little bit more. Um, it has a slight stripe detailing to it too. Um, but this is just an example of, um, for maybe for you to have some versatility in your spring wardrobe with both a more casual white dress and also something that is a little bit more elevated. Um, if you have something, you know, more of an occasion coming up, like I said, if you're a bride or for a wedding. So little white dresses are not just for our brides. Everybody can wear a little white dress. Um, but I also wanted to show you something a little bit nicer um, if you're looking for that in your wardrobe as well. 
Okay, so my second closet staple is of course a floral blouse. So I'm already wearing one, so I thought I would show you the one that I'm wearing. This one is by Reformation, which um, has been a recent love of mine. I've really fallen in love with the brand. Um, first, you know, they're really great with sustainability. They really care for the environment, but also their pieces are just so well made. You can tell just by the fabric alone that it's quality. Um, so you know that when you're investing in a piece, it's really going to last. And that's something that I'm really, uh, that's important to me when I'm shopping is I want my wardrobe to last. And that's something on this channel that I really like to work with you on is trying to find pieces that are not just going to be done after a season. You know, I think as a fashion blogger, I got sucked into that trap and it's something that you know, I'm really working toward is building an actual wardrobe that's going to sustain, you know, my life for the coming years. And I think Reformation, you know, also believes in that kind of sustainability. So anyway, this one, um, you know, may not be everybody's taste with the puff sleeve detailing and the button front, but if you are, you know, more pear or hourglass, this type of corset waistline with the buttons um, are really going to emphasize your smaller waist. Um, if you're smaller up front like I am or like smaller chested, smaller armed, balloon sleeves can kind of just balance your upper half with your lower half if you're a little bit more curvier that way. So this is fun. I have a top that's um, very similar to this at a lower budget that I thought I would share with you as well, which is um, this top that you might have seen in my Amazon favorites. If you haven't checked out that video, definitely check my description box below and I will have that linked for you. Um, but this is the top that I wore in that video. It's from Zara. Um, it was from this season, so you could probably head to your local Zara, of course, once the quarantine is over, um, and try to find this. Actually, you know what? I have seen this online as well, so if I can find the link for it, I'll put that in the description box as well. Um, but this is actually almost identical in terms of the body. Um, it still has the button front detailing. It still has puff sleeves, but the, the type of material is very different, and that's where I'm kind of telling you the difference with like Reformation since you're going to really tell the difference in the fabric from Reformation to Zara, but I still love this top. I've gotten so many compliments on this top and it still is going to be a part of my spring wardrobe. Obviously, I showed you two of very similar silhouettes, so if those are not the most flattering on your body type, I totally understand, um, but just a floral top in general is going to be just so perfect for you this spring. We know that florals are something that takes us through every spring season, but the great thing about florals is that they don't really, you know, go out of style. Granted, there are some florals that are going to be a little bit more kind of on trend one season versus the next. You know, sometimes they're more vintage, so they're smaller. Sometimes they're louder and bigger. But at the end of the day, a floral is still a floral. They're going to last in your wardrobe for a very long time. Let's get into my favorite piece from the video, which this would be the third item and that is the floral maxi dress. Um, so a maxi dress is something that we all gravitate toward this time of year. Um, but this one is from the new H&M Joanna Ortiz collection. I would not be surprised if it is sold out. If it's not, I'll definitely be sure to link it below. Um, and if it is, then I will find something similar for you. But this is just such a dreamy piece. I love the ruffle detailing. The fabric in the print is very me. Um, it has almost like a very botanical vintage vibe to it. The color detailing is beautiful. This is definitely a little bit more of a fancier dress, but many of us actually need a dress like this at this time of year. How many of us have spring and summer weddings where we're rushing to the store trying to find something to wear and we can never find that perfect wedding guest dress when we're looking for it. So I think having a dress like this on hand is just a smart move because that way when you do have those events come up, like your weddings or even bridal showers or baby showers, you can look into your wardrobe and you already have something ready to go. So this is just such a beautiful piece. The price on this is honestly really reasonable. I want to say, um, I still have the tag on it, but it doesn't tell me the price, but it was, you know, it's H&M, so it's a very reasonable price. Um, just such a beautiful, beautiful dress. Um, I would definitely wear this to an upcoming wedding. I don't think I have any, well, my sister's wedding is in May, but, um, so maybe I could wear something like this to her rehearsal dinner. Um, but yeah, so even if it's not as fancy of a piece like this, a floral maxi dress is just something that we all will wear throughout the spring season. I love pairing maxi dresses with a denim jacket um, and wedges. You can dress them down with sandals. You can throw them over your, you know, your bathing suit. So maxi dresses are such a classic. I think a lot of times as petite girls, we're a little bit hesitant to get into the maxi dress because of our height. But I assure you, as long as you find one that fits you, that is, you know, at the correct length that you're, um, you know, at your um, ankle, or if you pair it with wedges, 
Everybody can wear a maxi dress. It truly is a universally flattering piece. Okay, speaking of denim jackets, I just mentioned that you can throw them over your favorite maxi dress. A denim jacket is our fourth piece that is a closet staple for the spring season. Um, oh my gosh, like do I need to even explain this? We all know and use a denim jacket, but I think um, we do have a difficult time finding one that's really flattering on us, or at least I did. I actually have a blog post all about how to find the perfect denim jacket for you and your body shape. I will link that in the description box as well. That blog post has actually performed very well on Pinterest. So I think what that tells me is it's something that a lot of us are searching for. A lot of us are looking for um, you know, how to find that perfect denim jacket and how to find one that's gonna really, you know, take us through the next couple of years um, in our wardrobe. So this one is from Madewell. What I really like about this one is that, first of all, the price is very reasonable. It's about, I think, 100 to $120. Um, you can find it on sale often. Right now, I think Nordstrom is doing a sale um, site-wide, I think 25% off because of the virus. So, you know, this is something that you could definitely pick up from Nordstrom and from the sale and get an extra discount on it. Um, but what I really love about this piece is that it's very comfortable. Denim can be comfortable and uncomfortable, but I love how soft this, this denim fabric is. Um, and something else that I do really like about it is that um, this comes in an extra, extra small. So if you are a petite girl, sometimes extra small, it's just not small enough. So I love the fact that it comes in an extra, extra small. Um, and the button detailing is very nice. It's very comfortable. And the last thing that I wanted to mention about this is that um, it has a little bit of a stretch to it and it almost kind of curves to the contours of your body. So this is a denim jacket that I think has gotten quite a bit of hype. Um, it's a great you know, starter jacket. It's great for a lot of different budgets and price points. Um, but if you're interested in kind of finding um, some other denim jackets that might be more suited to your budget, something either higher end or lower end. Like I said, I have all of that explained in a blog post that I did last year, so I will link that in the description box as well. Would it even be summer without a bathing suit or spring without a bathing suit? A lot of us go on vacation this time of year. Unfortunately, you know, the beach may be in our distant future because of everything going on, but maybe you have a pool at home or in your local, you know, community where you are able to safely go to the pool. Um, you can still go pick up a swimsuit for the next season for spring. This one is just so stunning. Um, we'll see if I'm ambitious enough to try this on for you in the video, but this is also another piece from Joanna Ortiz H&M Collection Collaboration. Um, I accidentally ordered two of these, so if you really, really need this and it's sold out, um, comment on this video. It, the size that I have here is um, extra, extra small. So. If that size is sold out online, you can comment on this video. I'd be happy to ship it for you for the same price that you would get it on H&M. Um, anyway, the point is, this is just such a, a statement swimsuit. I love the ruffle detailing. This may not be as much of a timeless piece. Granted, the fabric is black, and, or it's black and white, it's floral. There's nothing really dated about this per se, but it is very much a statement swimsuit. So I can see, you know, only wanting to wear it for one summer, then maybe taking a break from it from, you know, the next summer and coming back to it. Um, I do that a lot of times with my swimsuits where I will buy one every season and I'll kind of rotate it. One year I'll wear, you know, these swimsuits, I'll take a break from them from a year and then I'll go back to them. Just a little trick because, you know, after two years, no Nobody remembers anything. Um, anyway, so the back of the swimsuit has some open back detailing. It clasps in the back, um, but just really beautiful. Um, I can link some other swimsuits that they had a part of the collection. They also had this in like a burgundy pink color in this same exact fabric and print. But again, all of us need a bathing suit, whether it's a one piece or a bikini, um, the choice is yours, but you can't go wrong with a one piece. Um, I still really like them and I love the fact that it has a little ruffle to make it more fun. And we're on the home stretch. One of the other things that I wanted to share that is perfect to get for spring is of course to update your handbag. Um, this one is just a really lovely style by Neely and Chloe. It comes with a crossbody strap, but you can also take off the crossbody and just wear it as a top handle bag. Um, this bag actually comes in a couple different color waves that are really beautiful. They have one in a light blue color, I think red. Um, they had one with like um, kind of like a white color. I loved the white on white detailing. It was really pretty as well. Um, let me see if I can open this for you. I remember the clasp was a little bit, oh yeah, so you kind of pull down the clasp and pull it up. Um, but yeah, so this is just like a great way to just spice up your spring wardrobe. 
Um, you know, handbags can really change up an outfit, especially if you have, um, you know, a lot of neutrals in your closet. Um, just adding a simple, fun handbag can really change up your look and make it more fun and more, you know, spring-like. Another handbag that I've been carrying a lot this season is this Croc Style by Brahmin. Um, I cannot remember the name of this. I think this is the Shortbread Melbourne. I'm pretty sure. Um, but I will link this, of course, in the description box as well. Croc, we have seen, has been a major trend this entire year. I think it's really going to kind of continue. Um, but a lot of those animal prints always come back around. So if you are nervous to purchase a snakeskin or a croc type of handbag or shoe, you can pretty much guarantee that eventually it is gonna come back around again. So um, I really love that this is more of like a nude color. Um, and actually the structure of the handbag is really quite nice. Um, I will try to insert a close-up shot of it, but it has a lot of really nice compartments in there to keep your stuff nice and organized. It has a middle divider with a zipper. Um, I think, yep, again, you can take off the straps with this one and carry it as a top handle as well. So just some uh, different handbag opportunities for you to switch up your look. Okay, so there are two more items that I wanna share with you in this video. And the first one is a little black dress. That might surprise you, but um, a little black dress is truly something you can wear all year around. This one by Reformation is actually currently on sale with the Nordstrom sale. I think this, um, is, this is Reformation. So again, Reformation can often be a higher price point. Originally, I think this dress was $88, and right now I think it's on sale for $66, which I think is a good deal, especially since this is something that you can really wear all year round. Um, but this is more of, I cannot remember the fabric, but it's kind of like a cotton spandex blend. Um, very comfortable. It has a really, really nice stretch to it. Um, and it's just kind of a little twist on a timeless little black dress. I love that it's very easy. To me, what drew me into this item was exactly that, the easiness of it, the comfortability. I know that this is something that I can just throw on and I can style a million different ways. I can wear it with wrap up wedges, lace up wedges. I can wear it with sandals. I can dress it up for date night. I can um, throw it on over my, my bathing suit. I can wear it with a denim jacket, a leather jacket. There's just so many endless opportunities for me to wear this. Um, but again, I just can see myself throwing this on in the morning, taking Oliver to the grocery store, running my errands. So uh, if you're looking for just something easy to throw on um, and you're a little bit hesitant to, you know, jump into spring florals and pastel colors, then, um, you know, you can't go wrong with a little black dress, even in the spring. The last item that I wanted to share with you was this linen white tie button up top. Um, as you may have seen in my white button-up top video, a classic button-up is something that all of us can use in our wardrobe, but this is more of a spring and summer edition. If you watched that video, you may have heard me talk about, you know, the difference in fabrics that you might see in a white button-up top. And this one is, again, that linen fabric, like I said, with the shirt dress. It's going to be a lot more breathable, more comfortable, less sweat resist or more sweat resistant, so it's going to get you through that hot weather. Um, the tie front or tie up detailing also makes it a little bit more breathable and more fun for the summer and the spring. Um, this particular style was a little bit big on me, so I may have to return this particular one. This is also from Reformation, um, but um, I'm just very short and petite, so um, this is the size extra small, I believe. Um, but if you generally wear extra small, and then I would check and see if they have it available in an extra, extra small. But Again, just a classic linen white button up top is again so versatile. You can throw it on with a pair of denim shorts. I love actually wearing these again with your bathing suit. You can just throw them on over your bathing suit, throw on your denim shorts and run to lunch if you're on the beach. Um, again, you can wear them with a cute little full skirt um, with wedges. There's just, again, so many different opportunities for you to wear this in your wardrobe. And so I tried to share some pieces with you that were truly versatile and something that will last the length of time in your wardrobe for the spring and summer months. I hope that you enjoyed today's video and I hope that you were able to find some pieces that you can add to your cart and do a little online shopping during this time of quarantine. Um, again, I think that these pieces are just very versatile. They're gonna get you through these spring and summer months. Most of them are very timeless with a little bit of a trendy modern twist to them, which I think is my favorite thing to do in fashion is to combine um, current fashion with timeless fashion and really, you know, make fashion forward timeless 
pieces of things. So I hope that you found some pieces that you love. Be sure to check the description box. I will link everything in this video that I can find that is in stock. Um, if it is out of stock, I will try to give you an alternative piece. Um, again, be sure to check out my denim blog post all about how to find your perfect denim jacket blog post. And be sure to watch my other closet staple videos where I take you in store shopping with me. Like I said, I have one on the little black dress. I have one on the white button up top fitted cardigan. Um, so yeah, if you haven't already, please hit the subscribe button. I would love to have you as a subscriber. I plan to come out with a lot more of these closet staple videos and leave me a comment comment if you need that H&M bathing suit as well. But thanks so much for watching and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.